lovely Edinburgh. It's so good. This is my family. This is my girlfriend. I'm up here for the first time ever with no girlfriend, no partner, living on my own in Edinburgh. Hey! So who have I been hanging out with? My mum for the whole festival. <laughs> I cannot explain the exquisite pleasure of seeing my mum do her first Jaeger bomb. It blew my freaking mind. <laughs> Something amazing has happened, right? My dad pegged it years ago. I just kept him alive for comedy purposes and to add some artificial pathos to my middle brow meanderings. <laughs> He's self deprecating. <laughs> so, uh, what I did was, uh, my mum's got, you know, there's two types of women. There's the woman that go, oh, my husband's dead. I'm going to stay indoors forever and go grey. And then there's the survivor. My mum's like me. She's just like me with a perm. She's like a pepper army with a perm. <laughs> <laughs> Full of energy, let's make lists till we're miserable. Let's overanalyze everything till we cry. We're the same, right? <laughs> but she survived. My dad's been dead nearly eight years, right? She's moved on. And those of you that are my sort of age will know what it's like if your mum's sort of 15 and she gets a boy. I can't even say it. I've told this story before and I can't. My mum's got a boyfriend. Boy <laughs> She's got a boyfriend. <laughs> my mum's got, Stop putting your willy in my mum, please. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. <laughs> It should just fall off after a certain age. It should just be a Ken hump. That's all it should be then. <laughs> but she's happy, and Danny from Woodford is lovely, right? He's like the opposite of my dad. My dad used to smash up the house if he can't find his car keys. Danny goes, oh, well, it's only car keys. Let's get a taxi. He's one of those men. <laughs> and uh, we went out clubbing recently, the three of us, right? Orcs or what? More orcs than the Lord of the Ring trilogy, right? <laughs> and my God, he's using our language. Random. Uh, do you know what you're talking about, me, man? Get on with the story. <laughs> and my mum's got a brilliant use of language, yeah? Water is never spilt, it's drenched, it's a deluge. When her phone fell in the canal, she described it as slipping into the black abyss, right? <laughs> when she was watching The Voice, even her mistakes are elegant. Watching The Voice, my favourite, Will 1am. Love him, right? <laughs> Love her. But she came out with her all-time classic, mixed with her worrying jealousy. We were out clubbing, we were all dancing, and uh, there's, in front of the rope, it's girls everywhere. It's girls. It's amazing anyone thinks I'm, or realises I'm straight, let alone that any female would find me attractive. But I'm happy to absorb their misguided attention if they want to lavish it upon me. And the girls are all trying to get my attention like that. They're doing that dance that I call mild stroke. Uh -huh. <laughs> Just call it vitamin D deficiency. Uh -huh. I want to help you by giving you some well woman vitamins or something. Anyway, <laughs> we're all looking at the girl, and I say, Look at all those girls, Danny. And he comes out with this. It was like a well trained dog that had forgotten itself. You know, when a dog that's well trained goes, oh, I'm having a great game indoors, I just pissed up the telly. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> I went, Look at all those girls. And Danny has said, Yeah, let me know if you need a hand with that. In my mum. <laughs> It was just as the dance music has dropped out, and my mum has heard it. Now, my mum, she might be five foot three, but she's like a crystal of anger. She's turned on Danny. You've just got to think of your favourite villain now, your favourite gangster, Joe Pesci, Robert De Niro, whoever. Mine is Ben Kingsley as Don Logan in Sexy Beast. My mum's done a full, slow head turn on him like this. <laughs> and she's come out one of the best things I've ever heard. Danny's gone, let me know if you need a hand with that. And she said, how are you going to do that, Dan, with no eyes and stumps? Thank you very much. Good night.